Joy to the world, the Savior reigns. But if we're honest, sometimes it doesn't feel that way, especially when the world we're living in feels cold and hostile. Even more when the church feels divided and loveless, joy feels elusive. Let men their songs employ. When we find our life is not what we hoped for, when our songs are filled with disappointment and discouragement, when we ache with weariness in a lonely wilderness we never imagined for ourselves. Has joy abandoned us for brighter people and better days? While fields and floods, rocks, hills, and plains repeat the sounding joy. But maybe joy isn't confined to just a feeling. Maybe joy embraces all our emotions, all our humanity with warmth and care. Maybe it's more about how God feels for us how he hears us, how he sees us. Maybe joy is a God who never leaves us, offers us rest and a seat at his table. Repeat the sounding joy. Joy is the king who traded his crown for a cradle and a carpenter bench for a cross. Joy is the faithful shepherd offering compassion and never condemnation. Joy is the listening ear and the gentle hand bringing light out of the darkness of loss. Joy is God's love making a surprising way for all of creation to approach, to connect, to forgive, and to be forgiven. Joy is here whatever landscape we're walking through, both this season and beyond. Repeat the sounding joy. 